Lots of luggage has shown up at DIA over the last several days, even when its owners did not. One passenger sharing these photos showing baggage actually lined up outside the terminal on the tarmac. Inside baggage claim, just about every available inch is packed full. Olivia Young tracking the issue. Olivia, just an absolute disaster, isn't it? It is, Jim. Take a look at this sea of baggage behind me. Now, this isn't new. We've been seeing scenes like this since Thursday, but now you have people who've been separated from their bags for days and new arrivals all looking for their bags in the same mass of luggage. It's a sea of bags, as you can see. Southwest travelers searching for a suitcase in a sea. It's a needle in the haystack. You don't know where they're going to be. Hoping their bags weren't lost or stolen. Air tag. Every, I want to get the brightest bag possible next time. I just have a basic black and white bag. Boulder resident Jordan Christie checked in his bags days ago for a flight to Pittsburgh that never happened. Basically canceled the trip, yeah, so it kind of kind of stinks. It was going to be a white, white Christmas in Pennsylvania. Christie was an initially told his bags were in Pittsburgh, then that they were being shipped to him, then that he had to come to DIA to get them. And now I'm here trying to find our luggage from Saturday, hopefully. Also searching the Lara family, who arrived in Denver after being stuck in Florida for days. My little seven-year-old twins, no Christmas, stuck in a hotel room, no luggage, nothing. After their Southwest flight was canceled Saturday and their luggage not returned, they finally booked a United flight home. We got out of Florida on United this morning for three grand. Now they're fishing for bags in the Southwest Sea. They may have been sitting here for two, three days. Hoping to finally bring their catch home. We're going to go have Christmas right now as soon as we get to Cheyenne and they can open what presents we had there. Now, once people do find their bag, they're supposed to find a Southwest agent to scan it so the airline knows that the bag made it home. Now, it does appear that this is where all the displaced baggage is being kept, some of those bags for days. But Southwest tells me that the airport environment has a law enforcement presence to keep those displaced items safe. At the Denver International Airport, I'm Olivia Young, covering Colorado First.